All right, let's do the thing. Go ahead and start out actually with a five minute clock, okay? We're gonna get into more of a quick warm up and then we'll include a little bit of stretching right in between. So for your warm up, I want you to set up a five minute timer, okay? If you don't have a five minute timer, let's just do 30 reps of the following. So you're gonna go ahead and start out with 30 jumping jacks or one minute of jumping jacks. If you have the room for it, go ahead and pick a cardio of choice. It can be jump rope, it can be lateral jumps, it could be whatever you like, but one minute of full movement, okay? And I want cardio movement. So you'll do that 30, if you don't have a clock, just do 30 jumping jacks. If you do, do one minute of cardio. After that first minute of cardio is done, okay? You're gonna go ahead and start down with your air squats. You do 10 air squats, okay? After your 10 air squats, you're gonna go ahead and go forward for 10 lunges, just like this. After your 10 lunges, I want you guys to hold that and go for 10 straddle stretch sit-ups. And then stand up and you're gonna go for 30 soccer taps. Okay, and you're gonna do that over and over until your five minutes are up. Remember your first minute is a cardio movement, so stay moving for that first minute and then cycle through the uh, 10 air squats, 10 lunges, 30 soccer taps. Oh, and your 10 straddle stretch sit-ups, okay? So do that for five minutes. You should be pretty warmed up. When you're done with that, we're gonna go ahead and start with our stretch. I want you guys to reach down, keep those toes pointing up, and I want you to give me eight, right in the same spot here. We'll go eight, and then you go ahead and switch, and we'll do eight on this side as well. Okay, stand up, lock out, reach down. Once you're done there, I want you guys to start the leg swings if you need to hold on to something. Okay, going forward and back, we'll do a total of five on the right, total of five on the left, and then we're also gonna go side to side. Okay, so both legs side to side, forward and back. When you're done there, I want you to go ahead and hold on to that leg, pull it back towards your butt, so you're feeling that stretch down your quads, and same thing on the other side. You guys can hold this for 20, 30, a whole minute. Again, this is the great thing about doing the YouTube videos, you guys can pretty much pause and do what you need to do and accommodate, okay? Boom, you have the power. You get to pause this and the whole shebang, okay? All right, so um, when you're done stretching that part out, you're gonna go for your good mornings, dropping down for 20, and take your time, squeeze the glutes at the top. 20 good mornings, boom, just like this. All right, and once you're done with those 20 good mornings, you're gonna go for 10 around the world, okay? Just reach down, go all the way up. You can place your hands behind your head almost like if you had a PVC pipe. And go for five to the left, five to the right. And then your arm swings. Five across, five diagonal this way, and then five the other way. Okay, and this is just dynamic range of motion. Remember, you've already warmed up, so this is just to kind of loosen the body a little further. All right, so for your workout, it is a partner workout. Don't worry if you do not have a partner, you're just gonna do this on your own and we'll just partition, okay? So we're gonna be doing ladder toe taps. Well, no, toe taps. Ladder is because it's with a friend, with a, with a partner. So toe taps, just have an object. Make sure that it's a sturdy object that you're not gonna like push away as you tap on it. Okay, so just like this. Okay, good tempo. Notice how I'm bringing the knee up towards the ceiling, right? I'm not leaning back, I'm not going forward. Try to stay upright and use those arms to help you uh, with the balance you're going to do 100 then you're going to rest then you're going to do 200 and then you're going to rest then you'll do 300 then you will rest and then you'll go back down to 200 and back down to 100 if you do have someone to do this part with that means you will do 100 then your partner will do 100 you rest okay so while the one works the other rests and you're each going to do every leg so 100 100 200, 200, 300, 300, and back down. If you don't have a partner, just do it yourself. Take a break in between, or rest as needed between legs, okay? Um, and that's your warm-up dash skill, okay? Now, for the workout, you have six rounds. So you have 20 sit-ups and 30 weighted lunges. So for your sit-ups, quick reminder, okay? You guys can do the butterfly. You guys can put your feet down whichever works best for you okay now the thing here is we want to use our arms to swing ourselves forward breaking this vertical plane here okay sometimes if you bring your knees up like this it blocks that vertical plane right you, you kind of stay seated back 
So sometimes I suggest for you guys to go to butterfly so you can break through. Now, be mindful that you're not picking up your hips and then kind of smacking them down, your tailbone into the floor. You don't want to do that. That's going to disengage your, your core, your abs, and two, you're going to end up with a pretty nasty bruise on your tailbone or a burn, okay? So make sure that you're able to keep those hips down. There we go. And another quick tip is that your jaw, your neck, make sure that you're constantly giving it a little shake, kind of like untensing it, because it's very easy for you guys to do the sling, kind of like grit your teeth, and it can create a lot of tension, okay? So those are your sit-ups. And then you have your weighted lunges. For your lunges, if you have both dumbbells, go ahead and suitcase them, okay? And you're gonna go for your 30 lunges. Make sure that you're taking a, fur, a further enough step, a far enough step, sorry. Okay, so you're hitting that 90-90. Don't shift the hips forward. Don't lean forward with the uh, chest. Nice, confident step and straight down. Boom, and push. Okay, you can even hold one dumbbell if this is all you have, like this. If you are not ready for weighted, Go ahead and just do body weight lunges, okay? So that's your workout. You have um, 20 sit-ups, 30 weighted lunges, a total of six rounds, okay? Have fun with it. Um, try to stay consistent on this one. The lunges are going to get pretty tough. It's a lot of reps, but you got it, okay?